G'day coin hunters. Once again we're looking at a banknote rather than a coin and this is a very special banknote. It's Australia's first polymer banknote. Not the world's first polymer banknote. The world's first was in Haiti in 1980 and it was made out of Tyvek. These notes are made out of biaxially orientated polypropylene. Pretty much the brainchild of a gentleman called David Solomon who started working on it in 1966 when decimal currency was first released in Australia there was a mass counterfeiting by a group of gentlemen of the $10 note and it was so well known that people were skeptical of $10 notes right until 1993 when the first polymer note to take over the paper $10 was introduced. These notes were only a commemorative note, so were never meant to be in circulation for a very long time. They're made in 1988, which was the 200th anniversary of White Settlement in Australia. They have some unique security devices in regards there's a hologram there this little picture becomes complete when you hold it up to the light and you look through so you've got half and half there's an ultraviolet serial number there the reason there's two notes here is because there were two prints of the circulated note. AB denotes a circulated note. AA were the folder released issues. They're all overdated January 26, 1988. They have a first prefix of double zero whereas the AB has a first prefix of one zero. The next two numbers are very important. A 93, 94 or 96 as shown here denotes a first print. This other note is from the second print from October. The reason there were two prints is because of the hologram it falls to pieces and the government and MB, P, MPB were concerned of the interference of the hologram by the public so they recalled the first print chopped them up and they actually become Australia's first wheelie bins so the second print has A more durable hologram otherwise it's pretty much the same this is another Harry Williamson note along with staff of NPB so this the ship here depicted is HMS supply and it has um, an example of different forms of supplying goods with the Camelies, the Afghan Camelies here. You have Chinese, Irish, you know, um, peoples of the world, which is what the citizens of Australia are, except for the indigenous ones. This side of the note had three main indigenous contributors that were commissioned. A Paddy Carroll Tagayeri, I'm, I'm sure I'm not saying that right, a George Malparara and Banduk Marika. So, like I said, this side's Harry Williamson's work. He designed the $100 note that I featured earlier. And the polymer is mainly the work of David Solomon. So 
Oh, and signatures. So the signatures found on these notes are Fraser and Johnston, being 1988. So I think I've covered most of most of what I remember anyway. Australia's first Polybo banknote. So in 1992, the first $5 note came out and actually replaced the paper note. Then 93 was 10, 94 was the 20, 95 was the 50, and 96 was the 100. And since then, we've had polymer banknotes. And this is Australia's first, the 1988 commemorative banknote.